everybody. Today we're going to do limited edition Pop-Tarts, Dunkin' Donuts, Frosted Vanilla Latte. This is the other version that I mentioned in, in the one that was uh, for uh, Mocha Pop-Tarts for Dunkin' Donuts. Here's, well, there's the front. There's a depiction of what it's supposed to look like. Then there's a, a latte, Dunkin' Donuts brand, Pop-Tarts. And here's the side. It gives some type of, uh, oh, uh, this is, these are the instructions. <coughs> and whatever kangaroo that they're using. And then there's the nutrition facts. And then there's the back with a little cartoon. And then there's the top. And then there's the bottom. But we're going to go back to the nutrition facts real quick. It says, serving size one pastry. But two come in the package. Calories, uh, 200. Calories from fat, 50. Total calories, 5 grams. Saturated fat, 2 grams. Trans fat, 0 grams. Polyunsaturated fat, 2 grams. Monounsaturated fat, 1 gram. Cholesterol, 0 milligrams. Sodium, 190 milligrams. Total carbohydrates, 35 grams. Dietary fiber, greater than 1 gram. Sugar is 16 grams. And protein, 2 grams. Okay. Uh, and, oh, and the assorted vitamins and minerals. Which actually, this one has a longer list. It has uh, A, C, calcium, iron, thiamine, riboflavin, niacin, and vitamin B9. That was rather odd. And then once again... Limited edition Pop Tarts, Dunkin' Donuts, Frosted Latte, uh, Vanilla Latte. Alright. Open it up. Find out what's going on. Now there are three, four packages in the pop, in the box, obviously, and they contain two per package. As anybody who's ever had a Pop Tart. And, oh, there's the package. Sorry about that. I opened it up and there's the back of it. Nothing special. The pop art written. Mm. Well, it smells like um, coffee, obviously. But that's the top. With, obviously, perhaps the latte uh, frosting. And then some kind of cream, vanilla cream frosting. And there's the back. And then, obviously, there are the sides. Let's give it a shot. Hmm. Had to get that little piece. Right off the bat, there was much, uh, like I said, I don't like coffee personally. But it has a lighter flavor or and a, and a scent than the mocha, obviously, that's supposed to. But there is a definite taste of coffee to it. Oh, and that's what the interior looks like. Looks like uh, the frosting on the uh, outside. You have another shot? Okay. Better view. If you were a coffee drinker, I would say this is probably a complimentary um, substitute for just regular cookies or um, what have you. This would be an ideal um, companion with your coffee. So, um, I'm going to park this here real quick. Try to, like I said, I'm not a very big fan of coffee. But that's it for this video. Like and subscribe. Share with your friends. And I'll see you next time. Take care.